Good morning. Today is Thursday, March the 2nd, 2017, about 7.40. And it's cool out here. It's 59 degrees. We got a little bit of rain during the night. You can see there's puddles over there. We'd like to have more, but we'll take what we can get. I think the rain's over for now. There won't be, shouldn't be any more. Most of it went to Charleston. Poor Larry's going to take his breakfast to Hardy's. Well, we can, uh... <laughs> he buys them two for so much. So we can he's go to Arby's. I just don't want to eat a whole lot today. I've got a, a game too much weight already. There he goes. That azalea there is blooming pretty now. Bye! Bye. There's a dry spot where the truck was parked. Larry and I found out at church last night that our picture was in the local paper. So there we are trying to learn to shag. And here's a second picture of Larry. I think he's holding my hand. That little bit of yellow is me. But we're in the newspaper. This is how I make my fried rice. I put two cups of water in the bottom of the pressure pan, and then I put a cup of rice in another pan, and add a cup and a half of water to that. And then I put a piece of foil over my round pan and flip the, the round pan down inside of the pressure pan. And it's setting up off the, the bottom a little bit with some spaces. So that cooks for 20 minutes. And while it's cooking, I put onions, I got frozen onions here, I'm going to um, cook them and in with the onions I'm going to add green pepper and cook those so when the onions and peppers are done and the rice is done I'll add it to all together and add soy sauce and that'll be it lunch will be ready I just remembered something I thought I'd pass along I don't know if I got learned this from my mom or what but if your meal is going to be late Put some onions and something on the fry, and and when your spouse comes in, they'll think you know that your meal is coming along okay because they could smell that cooking. So put that on, and they'll be willing to wait. Now he's going to go get a caliper for the truck and try to get back before I have to leave for the doctor's. I got a 12:20 appointment, and it's 11:25. It was a good thing that he went out and checked. They were putting the pads on the wrong way. So I had to take it off and change it. Well, lunch is ready, the fried rice. It's in a skillet. This is my plate. I'm going to go ahead and eat so I can get ready for the doctor, and then Larry will eat when he gets here. It's after 12, and I'm waiting on Larry to get home. My doctor's appointment's at 12.20. So we're going to be late, but he wanted to go with me, and he had to get that brake part. So he's on the road now. Ought to be here in another 10 minutes. So I told him we just have to be late. Since I was such a good girl, the doctor's office and let Larry go back with me. He's going to buy me a vanilla Frosty. <laughs> Once this line starts moving. If it does. We made it to the pickup window, so... We're next in line to get our Frosties. There they are. Uh -huh. I said, there's our Frosties. Too thick to drink. Got a lot of them set till we get home. The man called and said the brakes are on the truck. It's ready. There's men working. There goes the men. They're all done with the truck. Got the brakes all on, all four brake pads. Uh, now we got the trailer hooked up. We're going to take it. He's going to take the tiller I over to you. Steffi's. Now I just put air in the tiller tire. He's going to make sure it runs before he takes it all the way over there. Put duct 
tape over a hole in the gas tank. Turn the camera off and we got it going. Whoever fixed that hitch on the truck when we had took it in for the recall, they put it back on upside down. Now I have to take it off and turn it over. Deep South Homestead said that they had uh, figs on their tree. And I come out here and hook ours, and by golly, we do too. And if you can see that fig right there, there's a fig right there. Up there. These little blueberry bushes, they got blossoms all over them. I hope they're still good tomorrow. It's supposed to be 38 tonight. Waving. All right, got the tiller taking it on to Steffi's. I decided to stay here and take it easy. Maybe watch a movie. It's 610 and the sun is down. Larry's back from Steffi's. And the trailer's over there. He left the tiller there. He had problems with it. He got it tilled up, but needs tilled more. But he needs to do some. He needs to do some repair work on the tiller before he does any more. And I just uh, watched half a movie and then a show on uh, country homes for sale in England. Just regular homes. Well, I guess I, the, the, uh, my doctor told me he wants me, he was going to refer me to a cardiologist just to make sure that it's not my heart. And it could, you know, then it could be my stomach, but he wants to make sure my heart's checked out good. Um, I guess the blood in the left side doesn't always flow the right direction. So he wants to send me to a cardiologist. It's 6.33 and there's a little bit of light out there. And over here in the trees is a lot. Good night. God bless.